Okay, so this is the second soap that I made last night. I made these last night uh, right before I went to bed. I think I finished the last batch like almost right at 10 o'clock. And so um, I unmolded the first one this morning. So I was in the mold for about 10 hours if that. I don't have names for them yet. But um, by the time I post the video, I should. And um, I did another purple in here. And this one turned out so nice. Um, when I first poured it, the original color was just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. When I first poured it, it started to turn like sort of this murky brown color. But I learned my lesson from last time, so I knew the color would probably change, you know, overnight. And it did. It turned from that brown back to this um, pretty purple here. And it also has um, a thin gold swirl in there. It wasn't much gold. I put a whole lot of gold in there, just a bit. And I do think this base is going to discolor this cream portion here should discolor to a, a beige of some sort but we'll see I've never soaked this scent before and it's a little bit different of course it's my fall on up and so I'm trying to think the best way to describe it it has uh, some fruity notes to it um, it's like a plum but you can also smell like green and woods I'll put a, a fragrance description below. But you know, I gotta keep things a little bit different. And um, yeah, it's definitely a different type of scent. But I think it's pretty unisex. I'm trying to remember if I did a water discount on this or not. I think I did. It's about 20, 25%, I believe. I didn't do huge discounts yesterday because um, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure how the fragrances were going to behave. And I did add the sodium lactate, so they unmolded so easily, and they were quite firm this morning. I don't think any of them went through uh, a full gel, but they're still pretty darn firm. This thing go on is so pretty. I don't know if this is gonna zoom. In. Let me see. Oops, that no, I guess it won't, but I also did like um just a little bit of mica on the top, dusted it with gold and purple micas. which uh, will wash off with the first use. But it's still very pretty. This scent definitely screams fall though. To me, this is definitely a fall type of scent. And I am really digging it. I like this. I don't think I can get in close enough to show you how pretty these sort of thin gold veins are in here, but um, hopefully I'll capture it uh, when I take the pictures and you'll be able to see it. Sometimes I forget to do these videos because I get up in the morning I like that one. Get up in the morning I'm so anxious to see how everything turned out and what it looks like inside and I just want to just want to cut them open and, and see what, what's going on inside the soap. I'm going to cut this video in half. I'm not going to do both soaps on one video because I'm uploading 
uh, video right now and it's just taking forever so go back to trying to keep the videos a little bit shorter just so they upload faster so I'm going to cut right here and then I'll be right back with the next look